Astronomers using the Palomar Observatory found four pulsating stars changing in brightness over just minutes. In 2019, an international team of researchers from the United States, Germany, and Israel has detected a new class of pulsating stars. They vary in brightness every five minutes. We can tell a lot about a star by the light it gives off. The color can teach us about the surface temperature and the elements around it. Brightness correlates with a star's mass, and for many stars, brightness fluctuates, just like a flickering candle. Our sun pulsates as well, but its cycle is 11 years, and it only varies in brightness by 0.1% over that time frame, so it wouldn't be considered a pulsator. The team of astronomers led by UC Santa Barbara researcher Thomas Kupfer was initially searching for binary stars with periods less than an hour in observations from the Zwicky Transient Facility, a sky survey at the Palomar Observatory near San Diego. The Zwicky Transient Facility uses a 48-inch telescope and a camera with a 47-square-degree field of view to scan or survey the sky. Scientists then detected four stars due to large changes in their brightness over just a few minutes. Follow-up data quickly confirmed that they were indeed pulsators, not binary pairs. These new, tiny, hot stars dim and brighten every five minutes as their outer layers try to maintain equilibrium. Astronomers identify these stars as hot subdwarf pulsators. A subdwarf star is about one-tenth the diameter of the Sun and has a mass between 20 and 50 percent that of the Sun. They're incredibly hot, up to 90,000 degrees Fahrenheit, compared to the Sun's 10,000 degrees Fahrenheit. These stars have completed fusing all of the hydrogen in their core into helium, and this explains why they are so small and can oscillate so rapidly. These hot subdwarf pulsators could be related to another type of rare and mysterious recently discovered star, the blue large amplitude pulsator. The brightness of pulsators can vary by up to a huge 10% due to changes in size and temperature. The four new stars pulsate on timescales between every 200 and 475 seconds, varying in brightness by around 5%. Such a change in brightness can be produced by eclipsing binaries, so this needed to be ruled out before they could be classed as a new type. These pulsators burn very hotly, towards the blue end of the spectrum, between 20,000 and 40,000 Kelvin. Because of their low masses, the pulsators started life as typical sun-like stars, fusing hydrogen to helium in their cores. Usually, when these stars run out of hydrogen, they start fusing helium, ballooning out into a red giant. However, the scientists think a companion stole the outer material from these newly discovered stars before the helium became hot and dense enough to fuse. Thus, the new findings indicate that this group includes different types of stars. Astronomers observed their pulsations to probe the masses and radii of the stars and then compared these measurements to computer models of how stars behave. They were able to understand the rapid pulsations by matching them to theoretical models with low mass cores made of relatively cold helium. The next step for astronomers is to further characterize what's actually happening inside these stars to produce the pulsations and figure out precisely where the stars fit into models of stellar evolution. The research has been published in the Astrophysical Journal Letters, for which you can find the link in the description below.